Folks, I put up with a lot in the name of religious tolerance. Okay? I don't mind so much that Fred Phelps gets up on his pulpit and claims God hates fags. Yeah, he's a moron. He's an asshole. They go and picket funerals of dead soldiers because they think God is punishing America. It's stupid. But you know what? I can tolerate that a little better. Yeah, I'll bitch about it. Of course, but, you know. It's at least a little more tolerable. It doesn't make me explode in, in angry hate blood, okay? It doesn't make me do that. What does do that, though, is this case out in the Middle East where, basically, they blame the victim for being raped. For those who don't know the story, guy rapes a teenage girl, gets her pregnant. It goes to trial. Hey, sounds good so far, right? No! You know what happens? The rapist went free. The woman is now getting 100 or 101 lashes because she dared to get raped and impregnated by some man who could not control his goddamn libido. Guys, listen up. If you're going to be one of those guys that plays the blame the victim game, fuck you. You do not get to play anymore. You get to lose your balls, lose your manhood, and do not pass go, do not collect 200 fucking dollars. <sighs> I mean, it, it is sick, that blame the victim mentality. And you know what? It's not just over in the Middle East, and it's not just these extreme Muslims that do it. There are extremist Christians and any other religions, and even non-religious people, that will do it. And this is to all of them, stop it! It's not right. It's not fair. The woman has went through enough being violated, being forcibly raped, being forcibly fucked, and then having to carry your child because you... We're too stupid to use a rubber in the first place. Oh, then of course, if you're raping, you don't care, do you? Do you? No. All you care about is getting your nut off and showing your superiority over a woman. That does not need to happen. Just makes me sick. Fucking sick.